Welcome to Adventures in RV Living. I'm Julie. In this episode, we start off at Pacific Dunes in Oceano, California, and visit three incredible vineyards nearby. We explore both Santa Barbara and Solvang. We attend a few live recordings in Hollywood. We boondock in our birthday suits in the Mojave Desert, take a side trip to Vegas, and escape a wildfire near our campground. Many adventures packed into a short video. Enjoy. Good. Okay, here I go. I gotta stop looking at my phone. Woo! An RV. Yeah, we were way up there. We're at Pacific Dunes Ranch, just outside of Pismo Beach. Oh my goodness. What are you gonna get? Uh, thick mint chocolate liqueur. Yeah. Like the adult version of thin mint. Cool. It's a woman scout, not girl scout. <laughs> Women scout cookie. I don't like it. I don't know if that's normal. <laughs> normal for you. What a setup. This is by far this is the, one the I've most seen. amazing vineyard yet that we've been to. Oh, steps down. I mean, you can't. Ass. Wow. This is gorgeous. Oh my God. like this in your backyard. There you go. Different, this is a duck moose. Uh, walnuts, those are from our neighbors. It's an organic walnut farm next door. Um, this is a fig onion jam, some pickled mustard seeds, Marcona almonds. That's a fromage blanc with some dow honey on top. We have some honey bees here. Some olives, and those are that's a garlic clove on top. It's been cooked down and then pickled in turmeric. It's absolutely delicious. Mm. So if you like garlic, you'll love that pot. Yeah, wow. Wonderful. Thank I'm going you. to let you dig in and enjoy. Big boy. <laughs> hey now, be nice, kid. Hi, cutie pie. Look at the eyes on that guy. Yeah. Whoa. What are we getting there, Blake? Not the sausage this time. No. Just the balls, not the meat. Wow, okay. My first taste of an Abel's keeper. Abel's keeper. Good stuff. So we're in Santa Barbara, California on Stern's Wharf. Shout out to Keep Your Daydream for letting us know that you have 90 minutes on this wharf, uh, free parking, wood, wood. which is awesome. Check out the 
houses and the mountains behind us. It's such a gorgeous area. Yep. basically said to go to the GPS location which was about three quarters of a mile back. Definitely have to put a review up on Kent Radio. People say it's sandy in spots and make you think it's going to be bad. It's not bad. So we're on our way to Sin City and decided with all the lights and glamour and craziness that happens in Vegas, we wanted a night of serenity first. So I'll give you a view of where we're staying this evening. Our closest neighbors are way back there somewhere. What is this, Blake? Mojave Natural uh, Reserve. Baby girl's ready. She loves everywhere new. We got our fire pit for later. Little Modelo. Cheers. Listen to the peace. You hear that? This is our campsite for the night. Pretty sick. And there she goes. Blake, what did you challenge me to do? Go on that you're at. So we are out in the Mojave Desert and decided to take it all off. Become one with nature. So I must go up and around. <laughs> we got our fire as well. Did you, are you videoing? I totally am videoing. Really? Just my face? Of course. Anything else? <laughs> no, that's why I went woo up and around. All right. So. <laughs> I'm the only one that gets to see other parts. All right. Can live with that. Where are you going now, baby girl? She's like, I'm done. <laughs> I'm time lapsing myself. Oh, okay. <laughs> that looked really funny on a regular video.
It's like, I got you. Well, okay, you can stop. Babe, you all set? Thanks. Morning. This may be a little graphic for some people. So what's the lesson learned here, Blake? Teach the people. There's, there's two valves on the splitter. One turns on the black water tank flush, and the other one turns on the fresh water supply. The black water tank flush was actually on the time I connected it to the time that I went into the trailer, which was probably 15 minutes. It was filling the black tank. So when I disconnected the, or um, when I came out to pull the black flush valve, the whole entire hose filled so fast, it tipped over its stand, and then blew this out of the end. It can get really stinky now. Shut that off now, please. Main supply, there you go. That's good, thank you. I swear we're not rookies. We've been doing this about a year and a half, but sometimes you gotta learn the hard way. This side trip to Vegas was such a fun weekend getaway. We were able to meet up with some of our friends. We walked a red carpet and saw what I believe to be the greatest show on earth. So Blake, we made it to the pool that I've been wanting to check out. I know, and it's kind of frustrating because you drive as far as we drove to get here and you want to be able to find a good seat and then you get to the pool. And it's not even a challenge. I hope we can find a seat around here. We just decided to leave. We're at Starbucks doing some adulting, finishing some things on our computer. We heard someone come in, say something about smoke. There is 
smoke over here on the mountain and we saw the firefighter um, planes and everything so we are heading back just to make sure because it's very windy today like warnings of wind don't want it to spread out but the firefighters are on it so we'll trust that they will get that baby knocked out and there's houses up here so the smoke is coming from farther away yeah it's further away but hopefully it doesn't cross over that hill it could be a lot Still farther away than it appears, too. Over there. Oh, here we are getting closer. Oh, shit. So, what's the campground? Like 20 miles from here? But I'm pre pretty sure we head this way. service why don't you call the park It's amazing that we were that we missed it like that it was so far over north you know what I mean like we're very fortunate that we actually could even get in here because they could have blocked all that off it's supposed to be strong winds till tomorrow at tomorrow noon yeah it really is see it from here so yeah we are getting the hell out of Dodge and I just hope that everybody is able to move and this gal should be able to see okay anyways we'll keep you posted but we are heading to Palm Desert we're heading east all right so here's our rig and we are high enough up from where the clubhouse and everything is so we can see the fire so we are packing up and getting out of here it's still I mean a ways away the wind is pretty still pretty strong you can see the trees Blake's talking to the security person to let her know what's going on I know the manager of the park he's actually went to Ohio State so we bonded he's he went out to go check it out and then they're gonna warn everybody if they think it's to that point so all right we're gonna go pack up now